everyone. Thank you so much for checking out Crafty Little Rosebud here on YouTube. Today I have a haul for you all from a few different Etsy shops. Um, as always, I will link those below in the description. I also will have any referral codes or um, discounts listed down there as well to different shops and links to my social media. So we'll get right into it. I will start first with this beautiful photo album. I was so excited to use it that I actually already started filling it up. This was, I believe, the large album offered by um, Purdy Planner on Etsy. And um, so I did grab this and I will go ahead and show you it does fit my Sweet Bean Plans full pages, which is perfect. It also fits um, various different pages from Megan and Renee Plans. So here it fits my full box pages pretty well. And then um, it fits micro kits fairly well from Plush Papers. There's a few that go over the edge, but not much. And then it also holds, um, Let's see, I'm trying to think if there's any other shops I had already put in here. Oh, I've got some micro, crit, micro kits from uh, Cricut Paper Co. And as you can see, they fit. They do stick out of the top a little bit, but it fits a lot of stuff very well. These full pages from uh, Brandy Shop, they fit perfectly. So there's a lot of sheets that will fit in this very well if that's something you're currently trying to find storage for, the full sheets. So I did get this. This was a pre-order, but there are other designs available in that shop. And then um, it came with some little freebies. So I'll show you that. So we got this little November. Um, it kind of feels like a sticker, but it might be a die cut. I'm not going to try to peel it up, but the little November sticker or die cut here. And then I got this little sampler from Cupcakes and Stickies which I really like her shop and haven't placed an order yet. And I really like this little Black Friday tag here. Looks like she's going to have a sale, so I'll probably put that in my planner. And then I got this little sampler and it's a little moose with a turkey costume. And I will probably put one of these in my planner as well. And then here is just a bigger postcard version of the little um, sticker or die cut that I got. So that is all that I ordered was the planner. These little freebies were just a nice little extra. Um, and then my next order we'll go ahead and look at is um, Modest, the Modest Cat. This is a second order from her. I loved my first order so much and I saw that she had new items in her shop so I grabbed them. So we've got the cute little um, intro as always and you've got the little cat and sticker and it is packaged in an envelope that was decorated as well. And then um, I raved about the packaging last time and I'll rave about it again. It's absolutely beautiful. It's well thought out and you can tell they definitely put some care into their packages. So I got a second one of these and I will definitely hold on to it. Again, not sure what I will do with them, but they are adorable. And then we've got our tissue paper again. So let me get past that and I will show you my actual order. Now I think there's little confettis in here again. So I gotta make sure I get those all picked up before we completely move on. So let's see, we've got a little piece of pie and a little polar bear here. And it looks like I've got a couple of those and some little stars. All right. And then um, it looks like we've got the little Halloween bag again, which I've placed these orders really close together, so I'm not surprised. Um, and she packages everything just so nice. So we've got another little um, Harry Potter um, holding our uh, stickers. And then let's see. So as far as extra little goodies, we've got Choose Kindness. A little pumpkin, a cute little snow globe, and then it looks like we got some little winter stickers this time, which are super cute. And I did order um, some winter and Christmas items, I think. Um, so I got these cute little cats with like the winter theme sled, scarf, 
and then I grabbed one opening presents. I just thought they were adorable. And with these, you actually had different color options. I went with the more traditional Christmas colors, but you could have picked other colors to where they could um, apply more for birthdays and stuff. And then these, I absolutely adore the little cat in the stockings. And then um, this wasn't available when I ordered last time. She had drawn the minion, but she didn't have a full sheet. So I had to go ahead and pick up the full sheet because my daughter loves the minions and I love the minions. So can never have enough. Let me get the little confettis put up. And then um, the last order um, is kind of a combination here. I got my Sweet Bean Plan subscription and I got an order in. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the order first and then I will do the subscription last trying to keep this video fairly short because it's not a lot to haul but um, I've had a subscriber comment that they like the shorter ones and so I wanted to try to stick with maybe doing some shorter hauls for those of you that don't want to sit and watch super long hauls. So I got these two little samplers here. This is the Halloween one. I'm so excited to see what her things well I guess this is the Thanksgiving one but I'm really excited to see what her Christmas one ends up being. So we've got the little paranormal captivity again. And usually with her freebies, once I get one copy of them, I'll use the other copies, but I like to hoard at least one copy of it. And so we've got our little Thanksgiving theme here, and this is a duplicate for me. So I've already walked through it. And then I got another one of these postcards, again, a duplicate. And then I did order her First ever bean washi. Okay, there we go. So here is the little bean and it's got some little gold foiled acorns, super cute. And it's in the buffalo plaid, which I'm actually not huge on, but I love her products so much. And it's the bean character, I had to get it. And I will just learn to love the buffalo plaid a little bit more. And then, um, so as far as sticker sheets, she did a $2 Tuesday on these little coffee trays she's been doing, and I will probably end up with the entire collection. I don't even have a coffee tray, but I love her doodles of them. So I will go ahead and show you. Let's see, Let's divvy them up a little bit. Okay, so we'll actually start first. This is her Halloween one. And so it's got witch's brew and hocus pocus and a little ghost. And I'm hoping my camera will focus well, but um, so that is her little Halloween one that she did. And then she's got a Thanksgiving one. So grateful, thankful, and gobble. And so again, just super cute. I have no idea where I'm going to use all of these, but I love them. Um, if she just had a little bean character somewhere thrown in on here, it would be perfect. So here is the Christmas one. It says Mary and Santa. So I grabbed that one and then I went ahead and grabbed that same one in like the pastel colors because I do have some pastel Christmas kits. So I'm not sure which one of these will go best with my kits, but um, I've got both options. So that was all for the actual order. Like I said, it wasn't huge, but I placed so many orders with her that my orders never have to be huge. I know I'll end up with a big stock of her items. If you haven't checked her out, I highly advise it. Her freebies are always adorable. Half the time she gets me to place an order just because her freebies are so cute. But then she's also just always coming out with something new. So um, into the actual subscription, it came with this washi. And I believe they always come with washi, um, or at least the ones that I've gotten. I'm still new to them, but um, all of them had washi. So it's got this like space washi here. And then you've got Little Bean and it says, I need space. And it does have a magnet here. Now this is kind of a flimsy cardstock, but it'll still look really cute in a TN. Um, and then you've got Little Bean Die Cuts. And I'm about to just like make a collage of die cuts because I have so many that I really like and I still don't use them. I would love suggestions on how to use them. So we've got the little bean character with a balloon sitting on probably, um, is it Saturn that has rings? Um, floating in space it kind of looks like and then in a little rocket ship. 
So super cute. Now if she did them as stickers, I could definitely find a use for them. But these are actually just like a little cardboard um, die cut. And get them put back up. Okay. And then um, we've got this little journaling card here. Again, it's just a card stock. It's plain on the back. It says, the darkest nights produce the brightest stars, which I absolutely love that quote. I just got it put on an Erin Condren cover. Um, and it is in hollow foil, which I love even more. And then it looks like I got a little freebie here from Rainbow Bunny Co. And it goes along with the same space theme. So I definitely will have a full week's layout with this, maybe even two weeks if I want. So here are our full boxes. It says somewhere something incredible is waiting to be known. Good things take time. And you've got the little same images that you saw in our die cuts and then just some like space background. And this is um, a matte, maybe a premium matte paper. It feels kind of smoother than some of the other matte. Um, and then next we've got these um, heart checklist boxes right here and it's kind of hard to see with my lighting right now um, but hopefully you can kind of see them and then you've got some short and long checklists down here and then just some little heart icons and then i get it for the horizontal um, planner so i get the super thin washi strips here i might switch um, over to getting it for the vertical so i can get the thick strips but these actually work really nicely um, with just about any planner, so we'll see. And then you've got your little um, days of the week, and you could do meal tracker, spending tracker, whatever you want to do with that. And then you've got your date covers here, and you've got some little strips here. And look at this little one. I love it. I don't know if I'll use it. Now, if she turned that into a washi, that would have been amazing. Maybe I'll suggest it. I'm always posting on her Facebook page with suggestions. <laughs> Probably drive her insane, but I can't help myself. I love her shop. Okay, and then we've got um, to do's, today's, little things, reminder this week, get it done. And then down here, get your groceries, stop, it's planning time, errands, binge watch, currently reading, um, bill due, and then four. And then you've got like your little workout, car, cleaning, little heart, TV, lots of little TV. I guess if you watch a show each night of the week. Um, and then lots of little dinner stickers. And then we've got our half boxes and quarter boxes back here, some habit trackers, um, our little icons, a weekend banner, and then just some little extras like workout, a uh, nope, date night, meal plan, laundry, heck yeah. So lots of cute little things there. So that is all That is all for the subscription this month. Um, always adorable, always love them. I feel like I should almost order two so I can hoard those as well, just like I do with the samplers, but I don't. Um, so anyways, that's all that um, came in that and that's all I've got for you tonight. So thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. Bye.